With the release of the brand new trailer for Ninjago, we received a lot of new hints and details for the next season of the show. So then, the scene I'm of course talking about with this trailer is the scene in which we see Jay in the lighthouse, you know, Dr. Julian's lighthouse that we've seen in season 2 and season 6, etc. So he's there, um, looking kind of depressed with his beard, he's got that going on, and yeah, he is looking really, really depressed. And as a small Easter egg slash detail to also keep in mind is that he is clutching onto a bottle of water, which is kind of ironic considering Nia basically is the embodiment of the ocean within Ninjago at this point. Well, my take on all of this and my theory is that Jay is depressed, and I think we can easily come to that conclusion just because of the fact that Jay now has a big beard. Now, usually, you know, when people are going through a really rough time in their lives, they wouldn't really bother to shave and I think that's probably what's going to be happening with Jay here it's a sign of him just not really taking care of himself in that way and he's just kind of let his uh his facial hair completely grow out and I think that's kind of what this beard is symbolizing and what it's going to be meaning within the season and yeah he's basically shut himself out void of any human contact he's in the lighthouse a place so far away from anyone else and yeah he's obviously depressed because his girlfriend has basically just sacrificed herself for him and has turned into the ocean to help save him and of course all of ninjago as well so i think that's basically what's going to be going on and i am so incredibly hyped to actually say that with this knowledge because with the ice emperor for example zane there was an opportunity for an amazing arc within the next season but sadly they just didn't really follow through with that and the same could have honestly happened to jay here he could have just been his usual happy self optimistic and all even though his girlfriend has more or less just completely passed away but no i'm glad they are going through this dark route for jay and he's actually been you know deeply affected by this as we can tell from this one second clip alone and i think that's really going to be amazing to see hopefully the season focuses on this arc mainly and also how he overcomes that that is going to be an amazing piece of development for jay potentially being on par with what we saw him as in season six because that was an amazing arc for jay and this one it's looking really really promising to say the least and the fact that jay you know is just going to be going through this big amount of depression is going to be amazing and just to see that ninjago on tackling these kind of issues in obviously in real life this does all apply to that too it's just going to be an amazing thing and i hope that this you know, just kind of is relatable to some people going through something like this. Not obviously their girlfriend sacrificing himself and becoming the ocean, but you know, just kind of a rough patch in their lives. Hopefully this can kind of connect with that with those people as well. And yeah, overall it's just going to be amazing. I love Ninjago tackling more kind of real life dark issues like this. You know what I'm saying? And it's going to be amazing to see how Jay deals with this depression how, you know, just how he's in this lighthouse and all of that kind of stuff, and how he overcomes this, more importantly. And the fact that we can um, make out all of this from a pretty much one second clip of this in the intro is just such a amazing thing, and I think this is really shaping up to be something incredible potentially one of the best things to come out of this upcoming season but yeah just kind of wanted to give my two cents on all of this and i hope you guys do see where i'm coming from and also agree with me on this but yeah that basically does sum up today's video as usual if you did enjoy it please do feel free to drop a like on it if you're new to the channel and are interested in seeing a lot of content similar to this then please also consider subscribing to the channel with that notification bell turned on so you never miss out on any of my future content and also feel free to drop your thoughts down below on all of this in the comments and with all of this being said i will see you all in my next video coming out very very soon good Bye.